kanji that Japanese can read but cannot write. 日本人が読めても書けない漢字 Hello, this is Yumi from Japan. Today, I'm talking about kanji that are related to fish and animals under the water. Which kanji means fish? Can you guess? Number one. Number two. Number three. The answer is number one. Sakana. Did you get the right answer? Okay. Good. By the way, second, number two is to eat. Taberu. The third, number three, is to see. Miru. Now, let's expand our kanji world even more. Contents. One. What is the most popular Japanese cuisine in kanji? Two. A Chinese character radical called Uohen. Three. Twenty two fish radical kanji you should know. One. What is the most popular Japanese cuisine in kanji? Sushi is a very popular Japanese dish. Most sushi ingredients are raw fish fillet. However, there may not be many people who can write fish names in kanji. There are many kanji using the fish radical, wohen, and it is said that there are about 200 characters. Hem means the left hand radical of a Chinese character. The right hand radical of a character is called tsukuri. Two, a Chinese character radical called uohen. How much can Japanese read and write about these 200 kanji with the fish radical? Many people can probably read a few dozen and write a few if they are familiar with them, maybe. Usually, names of fish are written in hiragana or katakana. From time to time, I see kanji fish names on sushi restaurant menus and food packages. I can't write fish radical kanji even if I can read it. Why? That's because the Japanese don't learn those kanji at school. Recently, I heard that there are only three kanji characters, including fish itself, as one kanji. That have the fish radical among 2136 common kanji that are taught in elementary and junior high school. They are fish, fresh, vivid, and whale. Now that I know the reason why Japanese people can read but Cannot write fish names in kanji. Now, why don't you learn some kanji with me? Because the kanji with the fish radical is often used on the green tea cups as a design, especially at sushi restaurants. So it's very cool. Perhaps it's so nice if you know these kanji. Today, I would like to introduce some fish radical kanji that Japanese people cannot write but can read. Ten kinds of fish you will see in the sushi restaurants and the supermarket. Maguro, tuna, sake, salmon, tai. Sea bream, 
ひらめ。Left eye flounder。ブリ。Yellow tail。Japanese アンブージャック。When it's become the biggest size。ハマチ。Yellow tail。Japanese amberjack smaller than booty. Yellow tail is one of shuseuo. Shuseuo is a term used in Japan to refer to fishes that are called by different names depending on their growth stage from an 11 to an adult fish. Iwashi sardine. アジ、ホースマクロウ、タコ、オクトパス、ウナギ、ジャパニーズ、フレッシュウォーターイオ。You may be respected if you know these five kanji. You can find them at Fishmongers. サバ、マクロウ、サワラ、Spanish mackerel. Katsuo. Skipjack tuna. Karei. Flatfish. Right eye flounder. Asari. Asari clam. Freshwater fish living in rivers, ponds, lakes. Four kanji. アユ、スイートフィッシュ、ナマズ、キャットフィッシュ、コイ、カープ、マス、トラウト。Here are more kanji with the fish radical. Three kanji、シャチ、キラーウェイル、サメ、Shark. イルカ、ドルフィン。I hope you enjoy the many kanji characters for fish and animals under the water. More videos about Japanese culture are coming in the future. Please subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video. Thank you for the likes and comments. Thank you for always encouraging me. If you like this video, hit the like button. Please subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any videos in the future. いいねやコメントありがとうございます。いつも励ましてくれてありがとうございます。この動画がいいなと思ったら、いいねボタンを押してくださいね。今後の動画も見逃さないように。チャンネル登録をお願いします。